Hi! Today I'm going to give you some pointers for how to create more depth in the backgrounds of your paintings. Before we get into that though, I make videos three days a week with tips to help you improve as an artist and sharing my thoughts on art related topics. So if you're interested in that, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell. I'm going to demonstrate my painting Turkey on the Grass. Like I said, there's no sharp edges. I'm just putting smudges of color really. I'm putting some blues, some yellow, some green. And then as I get toward the bottom, I'm using pretty much the same colors, but this time I'm putting in more definite shapes and drawing in leaves and things so you can clearly see them. So I'm going to go back to the top and I've mixed up some transparent gray from transparent mixing white and ivory black. And I'm going to put a wash of that or a glaze of that over this top portion to tone down the colors even more and make it look even more faded and distant. I thought I'd include a photo to show you what my result is so far. Avoiding lots of detail everywhere in your in your piece isn't lazy. It's actually showing good artistic judgment. When you look at something that's way off in the distance in real life, you don't see all the detail. So you should think like that when you're doing your painting. In this case, art really should imitate life. The first principle to doing this is avoiding having lots of detail in things that are far away. For things that are way off in the background, just focus on your lights and darks and avoid any sharp edges or definite lines anywhere. Save that for things that are closer up. The other part of this is to keep the colors of things that are going to be way in the background cooler and more muted. Use more grays and, and blues, for example. And for things that are closer, use brighter, warmer colors. So that's the basic idea of how you create depth in your backgrounds. I hope you found this video helpful, and for now, thanks for watching, and goodbye!